I was like, okay. All right, it's fantastic. But besides that, guys, they kind of going back in style. It's been a while since we've seen them in grand finals. Reading a little bit of chat. Uh, and uh, Zay did pretty good today. He beat uh, beat a good good uh, Oryx win. That's surprising too, because the first game Oryx kind of won handily. Then the second game, uh, that was Zay was doing amazing, but then Zay dropped the ball. Oh no! So I thought that was gonna be you know the downfall of Zay, but then Zay brought it back. Like Zay maintained that gameplay that he was doing uh, <laughs> game two. Yeah. And just won three straight with the reverse sweep. Oh sheesh. My man Zay coming through. I didn't see the set, but I'm going to watch it back and just like, uh, I don't want to say analyze it, but just like kind of just enjoy it. Yeah, games four and five. Yeah, games four, games four and five were really close. I mean, it was stock for stock, hit for hit, mm -hmm. and Zay was just able to clutch it out, man. So now we're going to get to see Zay versus Kaze. Yeah. And I'd imagine Zay's going to go Fox the whole way through. I know Kaze. Yeah, he's going to go Fox. Yeah. It'd be crazy if he went Sheik. Kaze's not a fan of uh, Fox for whatever reason. Uh, none of the reviews are a fan of Fox. Okay, but I understand against Jason because Jason's a monster. Jason will just yeah. mess up anybody. But like on character character matchup, Ryu does have the advantage. He does have the advantage over Fox. Is that like a lot of reviews, especially me, don't like the way we have to play against Fox because we feel like it's it's dumb. Yeah, yeah, it's dumb. It's just like I have to do this the whole time. I'm just like. Oh. I, mean, I want to play neutral. I want to be smart. I want to be like an educated like individual. Yeah. Granted, I mean, you know, being an educated individual sometimes doesn't win you games. But yeah, it just we don't really sometimes respect the Fox matchup, I feel like. And Zay's actually one of the uh I mean, since um since Jason left, he's actually one of the guys who's like kind of like kind of goes through a lot of reads. Like he's been my, he was my bracket demon for the longest period of time. I could not beat this dude for for a long period of time. But, I mean, Zay's technical style of play just really lends to the matchup, I believe, because like mm -hmm. you don't really see him drop too many things. Mm -hmm. So once he gets that opening, he'll go in. Yeah. All right. Now we're gonna see Kaze versus um, Zay. I don't know why I just blanked out there. I apologize. <laughs> no, that's perfectly fine. But right now, uh, Kaze is gonna just do his best to like keep Zay out, and then once he goes in, try to get him with that up tilt. Yeah, I think what uh, really helps in the Fox matchup is if your neutral is insanely good and Kaze has the best neutral, undisputed, by uh, all the reuse. I would agree to that, yeah. Yeah, so if you're not trying to combo Fox to death, which is a problem like I certainly have sometimes, then if you're just playing neutral, Fox dies at 60. Yep. Yeah. 60, 65 is the perfect percent for Fox, and you can get him like that with just uh, enough up tilt strings. Yep. So Kaze is going to be looking for it, but he's got to watch out because Zay's going in. Well, I'm actually surprised uh, Zay didn't go for like the fair footstool that he would normally go for. Yeah, I think he was just waiting for Kaze to be a little bit further off stage because if he went for fair footstool. Oh yeah, the mid is a sure use. He knew he had the platform right there. Then yeah. I have to go for the dare, which was smart. That was genius. He timed it. He was waiting for the platform to come back so he had a safe landing. Yeah, and of course Zay didn't want to get hit with like anything ridiculous. Like if you're di but whatever the case, that was good play by Kaze. But now we're a little bit scared now because he's at 42.51. That didn't reflect. Uh, that was a little bit strange. I've yeah, you should be able to reflect that, right? Yeah, I've been okay. reflected about a thousand times by Zay. Okay. Anyway, getting the four there. Uh, oh no! <laughs> oh no, that's unfortunate for Zay. <laughs> what? Oh my God. Yeah, so he just pressed the wrong button. He was trying to press um, what's it called? He was trying to press another button. I think it was just side B, and just like he accidentally just hit B instead and just died. It happens. Um, hopefully it doesn't let him get to him. Hopefully we see exciting grand finals. This is probably the the night uh, the potential of us not seeing a darn reset. Oh, uh, now that you mentioned it, but it's okay. I, I believe in Kaze to not do it, but I also believe in Zay to make the reset happen. Yeah. So it's whoever believes in who more. Yeah, I, I like both individuals a whole bunch. They're both SRC brothers, both good people. Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> Stop hitting me! Uh, calm down. It's like when you hit the dog with the newspaper. Yeah. I think that was amazing. I think he was expecting a focus or some sh or some shenanigans, and yeah. then that's why he got hit. He got called sleep, and my man got called sleep again! <laughs> nice save. <laughs> All right, Zay definitely is having a little bit of trouble, but he's not that far off from uh, bringing this game back. Okay, Ooh. back to the. Okay, Kaze feeling a little bit of, uh, a little bit crazy right now. I think he was going for a maybe a less trump with that. Up to the. And th that's what I was mentioning when it was you. Oh, gets the reset. Oh, misses the bear though. Unfortunately, that would have been clean. 
That would have been hella clean, but unfortunately he's missing it. But now he's a death percent. Uh, I think maybe a couple more up tilts. Sorry, if he gets a 60, maybe, unless he stacks up more percentage on Kaze. But right now he definitely has to be... Okay, yeah, he's in death percent. Yeah, he's over. Oh, 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 good SDI. A, yeah. Gets the sour spot, sure, you could SDI by Eze. Gets another shot. Oh, my man just does it! The G! The just do it, my man sponsored by Nike. I didn't even realize that. Nah, dude, he saw the skid. He was like, oh, you're gonna skid in front of me? And you're dead. Yep. Damn. Alright, so, uh, a couple things. Uh, it's Source G G E A uh, Eze. So, if you could put that next to my man's name, that'd be great. And yeah. secondly, oh! <laughs> It's disgusting. Oh yeah. Don't switch to Zay, don't do it. What? Hello? Oh, Kaze. Oh, he can play. He can play around. Kaze can play around. Show us that pocket Robin. That's Kaze's secondary of the month. I'm not going to lie. Uh, Kaze's Rob is, uh, Robin is actually pretty good. And I haven't played it personally, but that being said, he has played against like Highwayman or Omega. He's beating them with it. And he actually got out of pools with his Robin. So I think it's kind of suspect. I got to look at his pools. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he did get out of pools with his Robin. Kaze's Robin looking kind of clean. I I've seen it, man. It's pretty good. And not looking clean against Zay, though. My man is like stacking up with 54%. Nah, I'm pretty sure Zay's just going in now. He's like, yes, no Ryu. Give me that Robin, boy. I can go in now. Yeah. Oh, my goodness gracious. Okay. We're trying to go for a Nair to stop him from side being on stage. Uh. Gotta realize not everything is plus on shield like it is with Ryu. <laughs> oh, him check. No, okay. that's not what he wanted. Oh, but he got everything he needed, though. That was good. Good cleanup by Zay. Uh, trying to uh, fight this um, this Robin. Trying to get him to pull out the big boy once again. Zay was going for a footstool. I've noticed that, yeah, he reflected that. Yeah. That Zay and Sylvan both really like the footstool combos as Fox. Hmm? Here comes the Vortex. Okay. Gives him the good, the best throw in the game in the fourth throw. <laughs> the best throw in the game? Yeah, it's the best throw in the game. He just... <laughs> just smacks him right in the face. I love it. It just like it just like arm bars you in the face. Oh, oh Reese God. air dodge was not in the proper area to punish it with it though. Hey yeah, man, I don't know if Efren's gonna be playing around too much after this. He might have to go uh, Ryu again. Yeah, hopefully he goes Ryu the next game. Cause as I said before, I don't want to reset. Oh, I, not that I don't want to reset. I just don't want to reset due to shenanigans like this. God, he was expecting a tech roll in, and uh, Robin was a little bit too high. Okay. okay. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah! He has the 11 sword too, charging up, third stage, got everything set up for him. Can my man make the comeback? Can my man actually shut Zay out with this, oh, uh... This shield pressure. What happened? Oh. What? Did you see that? His what? sword dropped, and then like, I guess Robin was like, oh, this is Brawl now, and it kind of like, stuck. What? She kind of moved and she kind of like, tripped over herself? I think what happened was he was holding on to the sword, so when he went in to go for the dash grab, it went for a dash throw instead. Huh, maybe. I. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That makes, that, yeah. That makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. So instead of getting the grab, he just threw it on shield. And then Robin probably has really bad uh, item throw animation. Yeah. So it gave Zay enough time to drop shield and then go in for the punish. Now we got. Zay has to win twice against a Ryu on Kaze's counter pick. Yeah. On. Because Kaze, if he's a logical man anyway, won't allow Zay to go to battlefield. Yeah. Because that stage is absolute cancer when you're fighting Fox. Fox gets like all the ladder combos for free. If that was me, he would have punched me. That if that was me, he would have punched me free. He would have. <laughs> I would have got footstool to like dare to dare to like, you know. He would have destroyed my soul. No oh, way. gets it there? Okay. Doesn't follow in with the dare, so he doesn't get the follow up afterwards, unfortunately. Uh, that was a good side B. But right. right now, these both. Oh, he's dead. Oh, oh no! This is the you input! This inputs were made! He's another chance at life. Keep him so, above you, Zay. Up there. Up there, this man. Okay, my man with the perfect pivots, trying not to up go there? in. Uh huh. Okay, where's he gonna land? Up there, up again. Do it again. Wow, cause it. Got okay, him. yeah. Good stuff. Uh, he got the. Uh, <laughs> he only got one hit on the focus. I thought Kazi was about to land for free, and my man got like, go away. No, okay. he's not. No, it's not about that life. Not yet. <laughs> not, not yet, anyways. That's that's game five. That's game five. My man is he resets all over the place. With the uh, absence of uh, Jason, we've kind of really seen uh, Zay step up as far as like the Premier Fox. Yeah. And I'm really happy for him. He's doing pretty well. But right now, he's definitely got to worry about this because he's at 110. I would eat that back here all day. You, like, as Fox right now, you just can't get caught by up tilt. Up yeah. tilt or down tilt, you can't get caught by. So I'll take the harder hits if it means I get a reset to neutral and live another day. Okay, that's it. Yeah. Okay, that's up taking that stock. 
Zay has a little bit of a lead. Granite's not much, but 36% against Zay feels like, you know, 100. <gasps> oh, okay. Up there, up there. How are you going to land, Kaze? 88% right now. He can definitely close the stock. Maybe if he gets it. I don't know if Dare uh, up smash will kill at this moment. I don't think it will. Oh, my goodness gracious. Does he know any combos against Fox, though? Fox is one of the... Okay, gets 38%. Uh, that's clean damage. Damage, damage. Yeah, damage, damage. Auto cancel that down air. My man challenges focus with Nair. My man is absolutely wild right now. 54%. If he gets hit again, it might be like, Oh, no. Oh, gets the focus just in time. Got him this time, though. Jab, jab. Up smash. I'm pretty sure that's not true. He hit me with that, too. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm gonna need you to lay down some truth, man. Uh, why come? I come sometimes focus. I get popped up, and sometimes I get the crumple. Focus one. Uh, there's, so there's three levels of focus. Focus sure. one. If like you release it immediately, uh, okay. it gets you look a little pop off or a little a little of a hit that sends a person flying. So that way, where you can do like dare or like back air or, or imagination at that point. Yeah. Uh, focus two gets the crumble, and focus three gives you. Focus three has full super armor. So even if you challenge it with like a force smash, why he's throwing out the punch? Yep. He, uh, he will still be able to throw out the punch and hit you with it. Okay. And it gives you the most. And it gives Ryu the most uh, amount of time to like you know come up with anything he wants to. So in that situation, because it was a focus one, Zay didn't get the crumple. Yeah. Okay. That's Zay good. didn't get crumbles. Yeah. Right now, Kaze with a strong start, already getting 56% damage on 72. He's at kill percent, ladies and gentlemen. He can't get touched anymore. Oh my god. Oh, yes, dead. F. Body. 13%. Zay okay. has to work through the hardest. Well, Zay has to work the hardest he has, he's ever had to work in his life right now. He's he's <gasps> two fair footstools. Oh, oh, no. Two fair footstools. That's all he needs. Okay, he's going a little bit wild. I'd like to see him calm down just a tad. I know he has to clean this up, but if you play impatient against Kaze, Kaze will absolutely brutalize you for it. 20% already. 37. That did 17%, man. Yeah, it does a lot of. Especially since it's fresh. Okay, use the Hydrokin to cover like a tech roll. Oh uh, no, one more hit, he's already at kill percent. More hit. It shouldn't be quite yet. Okay, if he gets to the <laughs> 70, if he gets to the 70, it's over. That's what I'm doing, man. Let's see if he lost again. Oh, 72. He has to watch his cooler the whole oh. time. Misses the tech, surprisingly. <laughs> oh my oh, god, it's over. Got him. Yeah. And Kaze takes Red Lion for the first time in a good while. My man came back with a little bit of fire. He was like, hey man, I was in Central Texas. I just watched uh, Walking Dead my whole life, and apparently that's a power up. Power up, man. Jesus. So we had. Hey, but congrats on Zay for getting second place. I think this is his highest placing in a while as well. Uh, it's his highest place in a while. The last placing that he got that was like really top up there was like I think top three. Yeah, so it's been a while since we've seen him in grand finals. But you know, hey, we got what four source players? Yeah, top four was source. But yeah, top four was source. Look like they sponsored the right people. <laughs> right. Just to run it down real quick, we had Ka source Kaze taking number one, source Zay taking number two, source Oryx taking number three, and then your boy Sourceman Benedict taking number four. Yep. But uh, to congratulate the rest of the top eight, who else? We had Sylvan uh, and Highwayman taking fifth. And then Murr and Balance taking seventh. So congratulations to the top eight of uh, Redline number 62. Yeah. Uh, so thank you guys for coming and watching. Uh, you want to promote anything? Oh, yeah, absolutely. So uh, it's coming really close. It's almost that time. End of the line. It's coming very, very close. Four. Four. We're having a lot of big talent coming in. We're actually having a lot of people that are like, you know, big in Texas. I'm talking about like we're having other people from out of cities come, come in. We're going to have, uh, of course, Elegant.